and welcome back to Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. Sorry once again for an another uh, del uh, delay and such. And and yes, I'm recording a bit earlier before uh, weekend next weekend. So and I did grind a little bit and got some new moves for some of the familiars. I say so. Yeah, I mean Billy is so good right now. So we're just gonna keep on going. Ah, we. So we're we're meant to go this way. So yeah, I think that I'm think I'm going to the part where I'm actually blind. So yeah, so we're gonna just keep on going. We're going on an adventure. Fortunately, these enemies will run away, but the other ones over there. Okay, I see the the, the different type of monkey, and there's gonna be some new enemies that we're gonna be attacking. We're gonna attack. We're gonna be attacked. Okay, this. Okay. Okay, we're going through the trees. Oh my gosh, we might get attacked for sure. Ah, weeb. All right, let's see what let's see what this enemy is. Uh, Wambat and Monolith. Oh my gosh, isn't that the company uh, that makes the Xenoblade games? Okay. Okay, they're actually not bad. Am I? What did we just happen? Uh, Billy. Billy. Jeez, you're kind of slow to attack. All righty. We did it. We did it. <laughs> yeah, we did. Yeah, it's gonna be a slow one. Yeah, we're gonna fight many enemies as, as we can. We're going over there as we can. I believe we're supposed to go on the boat ride. I am not sure. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's fight this guy. You wanna fight? Well, you got one. You got one. We're definitely under attack. Whoa. Whoa! Okay, Billy. Whoa, what is attacking us? Okay. Billy, finish him off! Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, Esther! 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 Okay, Esther, use your thing! Esther, Serenade! I'm oh, sorry, I was looking at something. Alright! Whoa! We tame Wambat. Uh, keep the Wambat? Hmm... Yeah, we're gonna do that. Wambo? Uh, Wamber William Winfred? Okay, some odd names. Okay, let me think of a name for this guy. Okay, I know I'm gonna be boring with this one, but... I mean, I don't know Wambat's gonna be useful, but... Yeah, why not? Drakbat. <laughs> I kinda thought of... Oh, wait, no, no. Actually, I'll add a zero. I'll add an O. Hmm... Ah. Okay, there we go. Dracobat. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. All right, let's go. We're on our adventure. Yeah. We're almost there. We're almost there. Nah. Let's go. We're going on a walk on the water. Get our shoes wet and weeb. Castaway Cove. Let's go, guys. We're finally going to the new area. I mean, we've been like two, like, weeks into, uh... Alma Moon. Okay. Castaway Cove. Okay. Let's watch this cutscene. Stop, thief! A thief? Where? Whoa! That man. He ran off with a huge pot. Let's go after him. You Come back here. You must pay. Someone has to stop him. It's daylight robbery! You're not gonna let him get away with it, are you, Ollie Boy? No way, we need to go after him. That's the spirit, proper brave you are, Mun. No wonder you passed them trials. Hey, 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 you know, you know, ah, weeb. I knew you would say that, Oliver. Let's chase down that criminal. All right, come on! Oh my gosh, why just spawn in front of a girl? But, uh, let's go after this thief. Uh, I mean, I'm sure he's, yeah, I'm sure he's not gonna get away, actually. Right? Uh, I can't open this. Oh, I can. I can. We got pie. Yummy. We got some delicious pie. <clears throat> ah, dang it. Why, she's, she's, it's her again. Let's not worry about that. Let's go after this guy. Ah, cake. Well, I don't even know why there's cake in there. And yeah, we've been like two weeks into back at Alma Moon. We're finally in a new area. I mean, I'm very slow at recording because, you know, sometimes I just get, I'm just, 
Sometimes I just... I You know, I've been streaming a lot and such, so... Yeah. But I will try my best if I can. But uh, this one's probably uh, need magically open. Can I open with... Um, uh, open. Where is it? Where's the, where is it? Well, uh, uh, spring lock. Open. Uh, fish burger. Mmm, sounds delicious. But, uh, yeah, let's go. Uh, oh, it's over there. <clears throat> He's over there. Dang it. There's no escape. Get back what you stole. What I stole? What are you on about? What do you mean I'm on about? That's a great big pod, of course. Pod? Oh, this thing. What's wrong with him, man? It's like he doesn't even remember stealing it. <laughs> what do I want with this piece of rubbish? If you want it, it's yours. Huh? Uh, 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 I'm sure it will make you very happy. See ya! Gosh, what's up with him? What's up with him? What the? What is it all about? Why would he steal something and then just throw it away like that? Why would he? What was he thinking? I don't reckon his, he was thinking at all, man. What do you mean? Well, he ain't bother what he steals. It's just the stealing he is in for, ain't it? You mean he enjoys stealing it for his own sake? Yeah, that's about the size of it. I'm no expert, mine. If that's really true, then he's more horrible than I thought. Well, never mind that for a minute. A minute. Let's get this old pot back at the peddler, shall we? He must be worried sick. Poor fellow. He must be, huh? Okay, let's take it back to him. Alright, we got the particular pot. Alright. Okay. I don't even know how to get to that chest over there. Uh, I don't even know this, how, how is it possible... Oh. I don't think this is possible to get over there, or is this part of the background? I see that chest over there, but it's probably just part of the background, because if you look at the map, there's nothing in there, so... Or maybe it's just hidden, I don't know. Yeah, it seems that way, but let's go, alright. I mean, it looks like Drippy is caring. Alright. I don't know what kind of strength he has, like... Is he... Does he have strength... Way more than, uh... Way more than, uh, Esther and, uh, Oliver? I'm not sure. But let's just, let's just, let's just deliver it back, shall we? Deliver! I'm gonna try to play much longer as I can. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, excuse me, sir? I think this belongs to you. Ah, uh, you recovered it? Yes, we did. The thief got away, unfortunately, but we got the pot back for you. Curses. I mean, that is so. You have my thanks. Cranky, don't be... Don't go being too grateful with you. It's not like it's flipping heavy or anything. Forgive me, it's just that... I was re rather pleased to have finally get, get rid of myself to, of it. What? 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 That man you chase, he is a happy bold thief. He doesn't care what he steals. As So as ever, I call him... After him! Stop, thief! When I saw that he's taken, I gave thanks to the ancients. You gave thanks for being robbed? In instance, yes. You see this pod, no matter how much I try, it will not open. Therefore, I cannot use it to store my wares. It is no use of me. Yes, you must take it. For apparently a thief, at least I could do. You're giving this to us just like that? Hold on a second. You just told us it's flippin' useless, and you're pretending you're doing a favor and just giving it to us? What's going on, man? Uh, 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 um, perhaps you will think of as a souvenir of your visit to Castaway Cove, Jewel of the Seven Seas. <clears throat> a souvenir? A great po big pot like this? Yes, a m most wondrous souvenir. It, it is no ordinary pot, after all. If the rumors are believed, it was once used by an ancient royal family. It's an illustrious, ah, illust illustrious and regal history. But if that's true, we can't accept that. It's too valuable. But you must. I am grateful for you. So very grateful for your help. Think nothing of it. Go now. Take it. Go. Be gone. Uh, okay. You said yes, but what do you do that for, man? 
What do you mean, Mr. Trippy? Did I do did something wrong? I mean, I mean, he looked like he's gonna cry if I didn't take it. He seems really world worried. Indeed, I was worried. Worried that you would uh think me ungrateful. Yes, that's what I was worried about. Thank you very much. <sighs> something very something funny is going on here. Come on, tell us. There's something wrong with this pot, isn't there? What well, wrong? Why? Of course not. It's simply that lid won't will not open, and perhaps not again. Spawn chilling, clattering in in inanimate from within. But only once in a while, it is nothing. <laughs> so the lid won't open, but the strange sounds coming from inside it. What could I mean? Oh, so that is a uh, well. I'll be monkey's uncle. Okay. Ah, uh, you know why it won't open, Mr. Drippy? Nah, man, it'll open. You just need to know how, ain't it? It's a cauldron, see? Really? It's a cauldron? Wow! You know what that is? Yeah, I never seen one, but my uh, father used to have one. All wizards have a cauldron, you see. They do? That'll do, only boy. The reason it won't open is because it's sealed up tight with a powerful magic. All it needs is for, for a true wizard to say all them magic words. Written in the Wizard's Companion, and Alakazam, the Pokemon? The lid will all pop off just like that. It will, huh? Oliver, you should try to open it. I should, right now? Why not, bun? There's no time like a prison. Go on. Give it a go. Okay. Uh, so the Magic Worlds are the Wizard's Companion, huh? Let me take a look. Okay, give me a second. Ah, weave. Do you I know, I know. Yes, I know how to do it. I know we don't have all day. It's kind of long. Alchem uh, 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 alchemy in the cold cauldron will be cap chapter in alchemy. Okay, I'll look. Okay, be right back. Okay, now let's go in the menu. Now let's see. Ah, uh, wait, no. Uh, no, let's see. Main menu. Uh, let's see. Wizard's companion. Is it uh, alchemy? Let's see, chapter four or wizard's page. Hmm, I Mary Conf <laughs> is it my name? Ma alchemist. Uh, let's see. Uh, does it say alchemic or something like that? I let me look. Oh my gosh, I am it. Hey, cart. Yeah, I. Uh, nasal can. Oh, all right. I re okay. Okay. All right. I'm supposed to actually find the words. Okay. Okay. Go into alchemy and no. Let's see. Is it this one? Uh, Breeze, this is food. Is this something, uh, alchemic related? Uh, let's see. Let's see. It's, I'm in alchemy, and now let's see. Now let's see. I'm very confused, but I'm gonna try my best to... Something to open. Okay, so, let's see. Cauldrons and genies, it said. Okay, then that's the okay. There it is. Open season me. All right, then let's let's go say open season me. All right, let's now let's see. Uh, all right. Oh, uh, open. Okay, I don't need those. Uh, says ah, Jesus is so, oh, uh. Hey. Ah, we no. Uh, me. Did I got right? Yeah. There we go. Whoa. What? Hmm. Uh. Al Kakimi, the genie of the cauldron. But it matters not. Your right to command me will be judged in battle. Huh? 
Well, where is it? Ha! Ah, aha! Now to arms! Oh my gosh! Okay. Already a battle. Alright, here it goes. Oh my gosh, he's he's Okay, I gotta do this. Alright, come on! Okay, I gotta keep my health. No! Dang it, he's already doing that! Oh my gosh, this is not good. Oh my gosh, uh, I'm not getting requested it. Oh no, this is gonna hurt! Okay, I gotta keep an eye on everyone's health. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I just gotta beat him. I did, I if I remember correctly, I did struggle with him, but I'll see how it goes. I am, okay, defend. Ouch, okay, okay, I, okay. Okay, a little bit longer. Okay, okay, uh. Do I, okay, uh, I'm gonna get Oliver out. I'm gonna use bells. Okay, I healed Esther's health. So I'm gonna go use uh, Frostbite. Okay, oh my gosh, okay. We need a, a ray, uh, Frostbite. Oh my gosh, this is, oh my gosh, this is not good. Alakazam. Uh, not this week again. What? Ah, I guess that failed. Okay, it's, it's a chance. Flipping heck! Is he really gonna try to poke you with that parasol? That was your chance to be... Uh, oh, okay. I mean, it's not like Princess Peach, like in Smash Brothers. So, uh, or maybe or Parasol Kirby, I say. I guess. No, no! Okay. Okay, uh, uh, Billy! 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 I need Billy out. Okay. Okay. Hit him! Is there a... Okay. Um, I'm actually... I'm doing better than I expected. I did struggle. Maybe I'm playing on the easier difficulty. Alright. Alright. I think we could do this. Uh, uh, okay, yeah, uh, he's... Defend! Billy! I can defend in time. Okay. Okay, he's probably blocking himself. What he's gonna do? Okay. This is not good. Boom! Did someone just blow up on me? Oh my gosh, ah! Okay. Frostbite! Everyone's fine. Everyone's fine. Fireball! Burn him! Oh, oh, Tansy? Tansy? <gasps> Will Tansy finish him off? Okay, no, 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 no. Uh, Billy! Okay, Billy! Block! Oh. Okay, so the thing is, I guess I get... Okay, I'm gonna get some health. Oh, no, he's gonna attack us. Oh, uh, no! No, Billy! Oh, ah. Uh, uh. Alright. Okay, oh, ouch! Okay, just attack him! Finish him off! Yeah! <laughs> Got him. We, we did it. Level up on Oliver. Cosmo. And I did. I'm not sure if the. Uh, I don't know. I the, uh, Some of them are made of morphifies. I guess so. Yeah. Or right, let's see, watch the cutscene. Ah, uh, ha! Uh, why would he just attack us like that? Phew! Are we? Are you all right, Oliver? Oh, your name is Oliver, Master. I'm. I'm sorry. Oh, m most illustrious Master Oliver, your prowess in battle is unsurpassed. Graceful, fearsome, yet merciful. Truly, you are a master of worthy of all. Kikimi, genie of the pot. Genie? That's right, Oliver boy. Every cauldron has a genie inside it. See? Uh, they do what's known as alchemy for you, but they have a test for you first. But see if he's worthy, ain't it? That's why a big, uh, big red bruiser t started on you. Nothing personal, like if you're after a cauldron, it's the only way. 
It's just traditional to see. Oh my gosh, that, that tailsman's probably upset that I opened it. Gee, you could have warned me, Mr. Drippy. Hmm, when I first lay eyes on you, Master, your diminutive size worried me most uh, perilously. But you humbled me. You remind me about a book that maybe never be uh, be judged by its cover. No matter how impressive it may be. I bow to you, Master. Now forever and more. Pleased to meet you, too. I got a cauldron! Yay! But how the wind do we even carry that? I don't know. It looks so heavy. Master, I must pay you in tribute. Uh, tri tribe uh, ah! Please uh, accept these humble gifts. A bottle of pixie do what? A uh, bunch of sour grapes? Uh, slumber nuts of leaves. You combine these items with the power of alchemy, they'll produce most wondrous magical results. I'm not sure it'll be... I'm not sure it'll be... I mean, maybe they took the idea from the Atelier series. Maybe that's when Arlen was a thing, so yeah. Now, let's see. Now, Master, seems to need an instruction concerning the rest of the cauldron. There are two ways to alchemize. When possess the alchemical formula of the item you desire, you may select follow the formula you shall have an instant. Wow. But you should not process the formula. You may select and mix match and combine ingredients here. Okay, this is different. You will produce most wondrous and magical results, Master. For your first steps of the path of alchemist, I recommend that you follow the formula. Do not run before you can walk, master. And this is your first alchem alchemo uh, experiment. I present you with a formula. Behold! Ooh, new formula. Okay, sure. Uh, follow the formula. What uh, spirit do? Ooh, 200 health? That's something. All right, let's go. Oh, it's actually way simple. Okay, it's not like the Atelier series then. So, yeah, you just need the uh, necessary materials and Yeah, there we go. He will make it for you. It is success, success, Master. Truly a work of wonder. Your culture is capable of uh, much more miracles. It can produce weapons, armor, medicines, treasures of every kind. You must take on your wizard's companion in hand. Try all the al alchemo arts to have to author. I will, Mr. Genie, sir. Thank you very much. I look forward to humbly serving you, master. Ha ha ha. There's useful, Ollie boy. Now we just need to bag ourselves the boot boat and we'll be tidy. Let's go, Mr. Drippy. All right, let's go. Uh, what is he going to say about it? The genie of cauldron? However, it didn't get inside, I wonder. Well, I'm sure you don't need to concern for yourself with such master. Please presume my wares. Okay, what he has for sale? Does he have a new weapon? Hmm, Billy. Eh. Okay, I do want this on. Uh, this will give me. Uh, well, let's see. Hmm. Uh, oh my gosh! Uh, bullhorn claws for Tansy. Wow. Now I want to give this one to. Uh. Uh. I want to give this to Billy. And then Tansy will do good. All right, this will be good enough, and uh. Hmm, interesting. Nothing for... Oh, there's one for Billy. I need some defense on Billy. The so Billy will do a lot of d good stuff. Hmm, do I... Let's go get for Tansy. If this will give you resistant fire. I mean, wish we got that earlier to res resist fire attacks, but eh. Actually, let's go... Uh, Let's get uh, 10 of these. I'll give this to, uh, Billy. Alright, I got some 100 chocolate! Billy! Billy! Creature's cage! Have some chocolate, Billy! You need to get strong! Okay, I know about your fullness. Don't... You gotta eat. The military growth limit. Hmm, there is growth limit, I guess. So, I guess this is a limit how much you could increase? I'm not sure. One point is good enough. And let's see. Oh, it's an ingredient? Can... Uh, let's see. Star drop? <gasps> wait! <gasps> wait. Uh, wait, I have this one. I, I got star drop. I don't remember. Well, I was grinding on my own time. So that means we get the uh, metamorphize uh, Tansy. All right. I mean, yeah, it's going to be resist back to level one. But all right, Tansy. Time to do the metamorphize. Whoa! 
Oh, he's grown hair. Uh, Dumbledore. Yeah. Yay! Uh, do I have any? I don't have any defense. Okay, I want to give it some defense on Tansy. I mean, I mean, yeah. So hold on. Uh, which one's defense again? Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, do I have any defense? Oh, I got plan. I'll buy a. Uh... Okay. Uh, I know I've been doing a lot as I can. I want to feed uh, Tansy some of the. Uh, I need defense on Tansy. Tansy needs to be uh, enough to take hits. Looks like looks like Tansy has metamorphosed. So this is my first time seeing this. So at this point now, I'm this is complete by blind at this point, guys. So. Yeah, this is, uh, this is, I think I'm playing on a much lower difficulty, which is honestly no problem. I mean, I just want to enjoy this, that's all I can. So yeah. Oh, another, uh, Gilders, okay. So now, at this point, I'm gonna probably go on the ship. Oh, let me check on something really quick. Oh my gosh, uh, Esther is low on health. I guess I'll go and, I guess I'll go take the N and rest. <laughs> like, holy wait, uh, Esther's, did Esther went down? In that last battle with the uh, with the genie guy, uh, let's go inside. I was gonna go check on something, but uh, uh, I'll take the end. How much? Fifty. That's fine. No big deal. All right. Let me cat people. Uh, did you uh rustle, oldie boy? Uh, memories of uh, hmm. I don't know what that is. Oh, regions of the world page. Wow. I trust you have another, uh, perfect night. Yeah, let's go. Let's see what's inside this one. And we got iced coffee. Can I open it? Let me open! Let me open! Uh, bar of milk chocolate. Yummy. Now let's get the wee body here. And Esther is full health, so yeah. No, yeah, she's full health. And it looks like, uh, Tansy is back to level one, which is like, yeah. But eh, I'm sure Tansy will catch up back up. So, I guess we're gonna go back to the ship. Yeah, we're going to the ship and... Ah, okay, let's open this one. <laughs> oh my gosh. More cake! 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 I don't even know why there's cake in there. I'm not, I'm not even questioning that, so... Yeah. Alright! Let's go see... Oh! Everybody's here wearing a swimsuit, huh? Swimsuit?! Yeah, and it's no wonder why they call it the Seaside Paradise of the South. Look, they're not dressed correctly. Oh my gosh, is this like... Ah, oh jeez. Hunt, so very respectful. Disrespectful. Uh, what? Knickers, is this like ding-dong all over the flipping again? Jeepers. Uh, come on now, what is this disturbance? Uh, Governor, it's the very person we need. What do we have here? Hmm, visitors of, out, out of our town, I take it. What? You, you, you gotta, we had to change? Uh... But we ain't planning on moving on her, is it? We're just passing through here like... Nothingless. The law must be obeyed. The dark days of the past cannot be revisited. We once had a great trouble here. I'm sorry to hear that. We never think of a look at this place now, it's so peaceful. It was time of great sadness. Travelers from all the world, all over our world, say to the Castaway Cove. Travelers who look, who do not always see eye to eye. The men of the sea are hardy but quick-tempered. Without constant supervision, they would soon fall upon the no another in anger. And for this reason, I despise the meaning of maintaining the peace. I'm sure you have guessed already what it was. Um. To, yes. To require all those in the town to wear bath suit, of course. Huh? What is he flipping crackers or something? What's the difference that would make? The great difference, the great difference indeed, fairy. For a ba bathing suit, and one cannot conceal a weapon. Ho ho ho! And no matter their homeland may be, all who come here to, uh, must dress in the same manner. They from Al Mamoon, from Ding Dong Dell, or from the furthest flung at. Islands of the North. When they don the ba bathing suits, they become citizens of the Castaway Cove. Wow, that's interesting, but that's a, such a strange idea. How would you convince everyone to agree? 
The whole at first, I am met with a ridicule uh, from all sides. None would support my scheme. But I did not waver. I remained true to my vision. I always put away my resistance and my frustration. And that's why I was able to show, show such restraint. Because I had a dream, a dream of this piece of place of my birth. Gee, I thought they were dressed like that because it was so hot. He hit me too. Oh, you're not the first to think so. But it only proves how peaceful our town has become. Such a misunderstanding, a happy one. I understand now we should respect the governor's decision dressed like everybody else. Let's do it. I want to become a resident of the Castaway Cove. All right, then we flippin' must. But I ain't got a swimsuit, have you? Oh, we're not a little one. We have great, well, the ba baby suit prepared for visitors. Just come yourselves. Come out. Well, you will follow me to my home. All right. Guess we have to wear a bathing suit. Whoa. Check me out, dolly boy. I look the business in this little number. <laughs> oh my gosh. You don't, you barely look different. Marvelous. Marvelous. <laughs> what the weeb? Whoa. Wow, she's pretty. What do you think? Sorry, I'm late. Wow, you're charming, Oliver, for real. Is he charmed? May we we may be boys, but entirely ignorant of more involved nature of feminine dress. Eh, Oli boy? Uh, I guess anyways, we're all citizens of Castaway Cove. Now, let's take a look around. Thank you very much, Mr. Ol Governor, sir. Oh-ho! Bathing suits are yours now. You must wear them whenever you visit us. At least I can say to you. Welcome to Castaway Cove! Thank you! And now at least we can look for a flipping boat. Talk about the fifth man, man. All right, we. I guess we have to wear these until. I mean, we have to go on the boat, so yeah, we're swimming. Uh, can we swim? All right, let's get the weeb. All right, I guess we're going to on the boat. Oh, who? Are... Let's talk to him. Uh, excuse me, sir. Are you the captain of the ship? That I am, lad. Captain and master of all who sails in here. Yeah, beautiful boat, captain. You do not need to tell me that. She's the most beautiful on the sea, seven seas. There is finer and more fearsome ship afloat. And her name is less no find of fearsome. She is the legendary sea cow. I have something to tell you, Captain. Would you let us ride aboard your ship? Mm, you seek passage aboard your sea cow? We need to get to Adamia. A vast girl. You believe you can merely stroll aboard. What do you think you are? Well, Captain, I'm... Captain, may I say what the what a cap, fine captain you are? A young man is standing before you, and I know it seems unlikely, but bear with me. The unsuming gra grappable lad here, Oliver, his name is... He is the only journey to save our flippin' world. And he's only accompanied by another than myself, Trippy, a lord high lord of the fairies. Oh, and I'm Esther. You're a fairy. I have traveled the world, but i never seen one of your kind before. So lad, you could travel to save the world with a fairy for your com for a companion? <laughs> then surely my ship alone will not suffice. You need two ships, ships, a fleet, even even. Ha ha ha! What does that mean? We can ride with you? But of course, boy, a boy. As soon as you have shown me the letter of passage from our beloved Calippa, the most exalted Lola, we sail after all for her glory, and that's all. Alma Moon. Should the Calippa seek grant your permission to come aboard, I will refuse you nothing. All right, Captain, we're gonna get that letter right now. Ha <laughs> ha, fine words, but easier said than done, I fear. So if you're really truly save our world, it should be work of the mere moments. Ha ha ha. I don't think he believes us, does he? It doesn't matter, we have to prove him wrong. We, if we can bring him the pat letter of passage, he'll have to, have to believe us. Let's go back to Alma Moon and get it. All right, we're going all the way back. Uh, Calibolula. What is she like? Looking forward to this. I am flipping. Love already, me. All right. I guess we're going back to Alma Moon. Yay. But do I have to still wear that swimsuit? I mean, we can't... We can't... Uh, I'm sure we have to change, right? Like, literally. All right. Let's go back. Please, this is not fan service. Please, no. Don't don't think what I'm thinking in this. All right, let's go. No, go 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 go. But the thing is, okay, we of course we change, right? Of course we do. When we leave uh, this place, let's go see. 
Oh, of course we do change. All right, that's fine. So that means if I if I encounter a new enemy uh, on the way back, I'm gonna cut this out and yeah, we're going all the way back to Al Moon. We're gonna walk. Ah, uh, he's gonna attack me. Ah. Okay, I never I I uh, monolith. We already fought them, so all right, let's get out of here. Uh, we'll just, we'll beat them and I'll meet you back at Al Moon. If there's a new enemy I never fought, I will I will put a video in. Oh, looks like Tansy's level four. But I'm just gonna focus on the game, and then I'll probably grind a little bit for Tansy. Maybe. Because Tansy is... Well, Tansy will get strong. It's gonna be the same as Billy. So, yeah. Wait, dude, I never fought this guy. Ah! Yeah, I never fought Hog Goblin. Alright, can I attack the Hog Goblin? Alright, attack the Hog Goblin! No! Oh, wait, it, oh! Okay, uh, you... Oh, yeah, um, uh, let's go recruit the... Let's get the hog goblin! Serenade! Alright, we got the hog goblin! Yay! Definitely Nito, for sure, for getting the hog goblin. And Tansy, of course, leveled up. Now, what do we name hog goblin? What? Hogsword? Oh my, it's a hog, hog's wart. All right, let's go think of a name. All right, Rasher. Let's go with Rasher. Now let's get, all right, let's, let's for real go back to Mountain Moon and see what happens. No, oh, get away! You, you weeping feet cat. Okay, uh, okay, we managed to get away, holy weep, okay. <laughs> all right, we're back here. We just need to get a letter in order to get permission. So where do we need to go exactly? Weren't you listening, cloth ears? Where the Kaliba is, ain't it? To the palace, man, the palace. It's beyond main the square, oh, Oliver. Let's I'll show the way. All right, I let's go. Huh? Hmm? Yikes! What's wrong, Esther? Nothing, I just had a funny feeling we we're being followed for a second. I'm sure it's nothing. Sorry, let's get going, shall we? Sure. By the beards of the mighty, the regal lines, the majestic curve of the nostril, your nose is in every respect of the same, the same as hers. I'm sorry? Please, you must be let, let me study it. What? Who are you? Ah, uh, forgive me. I am the humble artist. I am currently painting the portrait of one of you. Most striking resemblance. Do I look like the person in your portrait? Indeed, and alas, I am unable to meet her in the flesh. Will you allow me to study you a little? Okay, this is this is this is weird. What? No. He, okay, he is. Okay, can you back off? He he is suspicious. That's the line of the j jaws keys. Yes, of course. Thank you. I am near death. I know what to do with my finish my masterpiece. Yeah, my internal gratitude. Um, that's all right. You, you're very welcome. I must return to my studio, studio right now. Farewell. Wow, I wonder who this person is who looks like me. Whoever this is, this artist is seem, seems to be she's rather beautiful. Crikey, an artist type. A bit intense, ain't it? Nothing mentioned a bit flippin' weird. Dang right it is. What you mean? Oh, just nothing. As you know, he was a bit funny one. D did you not think so? It's it just me. Was it right, though? I'll shut up my big mouth, shall I? It's time to get moving, is it? Sure, let's go. All right, let's go. We're going to the palace. And shall we say hi to him? There's a great sage. Yeah, I know that. Let's go find the sage, but I need to go in. There's pigeons! Birds! Fly away, birds! Fly away, birds! Ah, I just flew into Oliver's face! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my gosh. Tiny, this is here's palace. Let's get ourselves inside, shall we? So much... Yeah, so much we've been, like, in back... Stuck at, uh, Al Moon for, like... Ugh! Halt! You may not pass. You think you can just walk in the palace to our most revered... Calippa unannounced? What seems to be a problem here? Master of Ball. <laughs> These miscreants are attempting to enter the palace without permission. 
Is that so? Wait, are you Babana's merchant daughter, are you not? I am Abol, vizier of the Istem Kalipa, your father's efforts to study her ma magnificent with Babana's are as ever most highly appreciated. I heard, I have heard that you guys were unwell. It seems that you are, are recovered. Yes, I'm so much better now. Thank you. As this ex excellent news. Tell me, child, what business you have at this palace? Well, sir, we need the we need a ship, and we can't get one without a letter of passage from the Caliba. And your friends wish to journey on the lands across the sea. I sympathize. I would dearly love to arrange on the audience with the, for you. However. Is something wrong? I'm afraid that the Caliba is indisposed. Much as it would please her, she's currently unable to hear the request of any of her subjects. Oh, that's too bad. Apologies, but she has requested that she not be disturbed by under any circumstances during her afternoon snack. Then I guess we'll have to wait until after that. Would that, would that, would you, would, but her afternoon snack is immediately followed by her second lunch. And after that? And she comes to her late afternoon snack. Is there, is there any time when she's not eating? Alas, her moods to see miraculous hunger dictates. Uh, dictates that she's dying. Even her uh, sleeping hours. That's why I'm forced to s spend my uh, every walking uh, hour uh, procuring her most loved her loved food. Ah, I must be going. Her beloved food? I wonder what could that be? Forgive me, I must take unnecessary arrangements before the merchant's supplies are exhausted. I am most terribly sorry that I am unable to grant you any audience. Curses, I must hurry. If I don't prepare her mood to see, next meal will be in good time. She will be most displeased. Master of all has spoken. Leave this place. Looks like we don't have much of choice, Oliver. Come on, we have to come back later. So the Kalipa is, is, is a very special favorite food, isn't it? Hey, I believe if we found out then it was and took her some of her as a present, we'll be allowed to see her. That's a neat idea, Esther, but we don't know what's her favorite food is. Oh, Oli boy! You know that we can we can find out, don't you? Um, come on, slow couch. You got your world and find her soulmate, ain't it? Of course, but we have to find her soulmate. We can find out what's her favorite food is and give her some of the Kalipa. But how, uh, how do we find out who the Caliba soulmate is? i never seen her before. Hmm, we need to find out what uh, Caliba looks like. But we can't go and meet her. But we can meet her. How are we supposed to find out what she looks like? I have saw her once in a parade when I was little, but it was so long ago. I can't remember anything about her. So what do we do? Jeepers. We don't know what the Caliba's favorite food is, and we don't know what she looks like. I have to confess, I'm completely out of ideas too. Bah! This is all the thinking making my head hurt, man. I'll tell you what, let's go down to the cat's cradle and sleep on it, shall we? Well, I guess I'm kind of tired. The cat's cradle is near the entrance to the town. Okay, let's go rest a while. Yeah, we're gonna... Yeah, we're gonna go rest. Yeah, looks like we need to know what she looks like, and... Because we need our permission! We need our permission to get to the ship, but... Eh, some circumstances and weed. Like, why? Why? Oh, it's going, but it's not worried about that. Let's just go to bed! Let's go to bed! Shall we? This is gonna be very blind. Birds, fly away! Don't fly into my face again! Okay, thank you. Now let's go in. Alright, let's take the rest. Welcome to the Palace of Pampering, the cream of cat's cradle establishment. <gasps> oh my! <laughs> I must apologize. Oh, oh, please, you must excuse me. Is it finished? Oh, is it, it is really the paint finished? Is oh. dry, but it is completed at last. Oh, how I had long to see it. Now, please oh. hang it over here. Isn't that the artist who? Yes, it is. I wonder how his picture turned out. At last, the grand unveiling. Oh, my beloved Khalifa. So the person he thought I looked like was. The Khalifa. There's fancy. It's not every day you get compared to royalty. Now feast your eyes upon the divine beauty oh, of her most admired oh, majesty. Oh, 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 oh. Huh? But that's... 
Oh, it is divine, truly divine. Her matchless beauty takes one's breath away. You are pleased with it? Please, why it's worth twice as what I promised to pay for you for it. But the bears are the mighty, truly. Well, we shook upon it, do we not? Do we, did we not? Perhaps next time. I, I, I see. Excuse me? Yes? I don't look anything like her. Hmm? You said I look like her. You must understand, young lady. It is not a picture of you, you merely. Mr. Drippy! Eh? What is it, man? This is just getting interesting. We need to go to Motorville right now. I just realized who we need to see. You did, eh? I sure did. Miss Lilia is a caliber soulmate. I just know she is. Of course she is. There's clever of you, Olive Boy. Thanks, Mr. Drippy. When I saw that picture, I knew it right away. Right, let's get on moving in, shall we? I don't feel tired all of a sudden. Me either. Hey, Esther. Come on, we have to go. Huh? Oh my, she, oh my gosh. She's upset. Hmm. Hmm. I look absolutely nothing like her. Yeah, I'm, that's true. Do I look fat to you? I am not fat. Huh? Hey. You're still kind of angry, huh? What do you mean? I am not angry in the slightest. Oh no. Hope she's not a Zundale. She's definitely not one. Maybe she's just upset. Yeah, I'm looking... I am six f uh, foot flipping six. Looks like we best leave her to it. I guess we should, huh? Alright, I guess we're going to see her. Uh, do I go... Let me go outside. I mean, is people going to see me teleport? I guess I'll go teleport out of here. Alright, teleport! A uh, gateway! And I gotta go find her. Oh no, this guy saw me! <laughs> he just saw me! No! <laughs> I was like, oh, oh, who, what that kid just done? Where'd that kid go? Like, uh, he, oh, uh, he better not tell on us. All right, let's go see. <clears throat> uh, Lilia's milk bar. Yeah, we're going, the door's closed? <gasps> what? How is she still with us? Wait a minute, how is she still with us? I'm sure we wait right there. She'll be along soon. It's time to open up already. Someone's coming. I think only... I think... Oh no, it's... I think... Oh no, that, that Myrtle is uh, Esther's soulmate. Oh, hello, Oliver. Myrtle, hi. How are you? Are you feeling better now? I am. It's all thanks to you, Oliver. What are you doing here? Do you need something from the store? Wait a moment. I'll just open up for to you. Wait, wait, what? Who's this girl? I feel like... Like you, like you know her somehow? Yes, she looks just like me! It's like she's my long-lost twin or something. She looks more like me and that stupid cow, Calipia. Oh my gosh. Can she not see me? I don't think she can. It's pers- Yeah, she can't see you. Or you. Yeah, only Oliver. Really? I'm so invisible. Oh, that's a strange feeling. Oh. Of course you're invisible. You're from another world, ain't it? Uh, did you say something, Oliver? Oh, no, I didn't. Anyway, you come here to see at Miss Lilia Storm Myrtle? He, I work here now. What? But where's Myrtle? Miss Lilia and my mom are friends, so when she when she heard that I was better, she said I could I should come work for her. What? Is she te is she see too young for that? Gee, that's real nice of her. Hey Myrtle, is Miss Lilia around? Sure, she's busy training right now. I'm sure she'll be back soon. What? what? Miss Lilia? Training? That's right. She started running. Is she on a diet? Hee <laughs> hee, no silly. She's excited, excited that she can eat even more. Oh, what do you, how do you mean? Oh! Ah, ah, Myrtle, I'm back! Why, is it been Leong Oliver? Hello, Derry. Good, good morning, Miss Lilia. Myrtle, I can't, oh, I can't wait any longer, would you? Yes, Miss Lilia, I'll go get it for you right now. Oh, and it's no good. I can't just wait a long, a long, a, 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 a wait that long. I have something store there. You stay out there and clean or something. My, I never saw anyone so crazy about their favorite food. What was that? Did she say f favorite food? Oh, oh, holy boy! I bet it's the same as the Calipas. You're right. Let's go find out what that is. See you, Miss. Uh, see you, Myrtle. Miss Layla, what is she eating? It's cheese. A whole lot of cheese. That's right, dearie, and it's not for sale. None of it. It's all for little old me. 
Quick, Ollie boy! She'll scoff the whole lot if you're not careful. Hurry up and grab some! Sharpish! Okay. Please, Miss Layla. Could you give me a piece of your cheese? Uh, 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 you know I'd do anything for you, dearie, but please, not that. Just oh, one no, piece. No, no, no. Just one no, tiny I said little piece. Mine. mine. Eve, with all you your might. Uh, I'll never let you have it. it. It's, it's go mine. Go mine, oh. I tell you. All oh. mine. Oh, my gosh. That is not... Ah, jeez. It's kind of shocking, huh? Sure is. I have no idea. I have no idea she... I have no idea she was so obsessed. Hee hee, it's better not to go near her when she's eating cheese. Uh, I know that now. Myrtle, Myrtle. Sounds like she needs my help. I better go inside. Goodbye now. Alright, at least we know... Jeepers. So what do we do now? Miss Leah's store is only a place in the town that sells cheese. Oliver, what's wrong? Oh, hi, Pia. We kind of need some cheese. Cheese? That's right. It's the Cal Lippo's favorite food. Who is he talking to? It must be his imaginary friend again. Here we flip and go. Can we... Huh? We can make it? Make our own cheese? Yes, with your magic. Lots and lots of cheese. Oh, is this alchemy? Will the genie guy make it for us? I don't know how. Yes, you do. You just try. Just try. You really think it's that easy? Yes. But do I even have to spell that I can do that? Hey, wait! She's gone. Have you fun- have fun talking to your imaginary friend? Hey, did you? Only boy is better talking to your real friends, was it? Uh, imaginary friend? You mean Pei? Pei, who's that? What you mean? She was right there. Um, I don't see anyone. Maybe you can only see her, Oliver. Really? How come? Well, maybe it's just like Myrtle can't see us, but I can see her. You may be right, but I've never seen this P either. Anyway, what does P say the P say to you, Oliver? Oh yeah, she told me to use my magic to make some cheese. What's that? Make it with your magic, say? She may be too shy to let her see her. She ain't too afraid to stick her to stick her neck advice wise. You mean it won't work? No man, it'll work. The whole point of the magic is to make the impossible impossible, ain't it? I guess I guess but I guess it's difficult without the right ingredients, huh? We do have them. We do? Of course, back at Alma Moon. The fountains of milk. Fountains of what? So we we use magic to turn milk from fountains into cheese? Now we can do tidy. Right, oh Ollie boy. Let's get back to your our world, shall we? Alright. I guess we're going back. Let's go straight to fountain milk. Okay, we're gonna make cheese for Caliba. No. Uh no 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 no. Uh magic, magic, uh gateway! I hope no one will see us. We're back in a different area this time. Oh my gosh. All right, now, where do we even go? It shows, but, uh... Okay, it's over there. I see it. So, we're gonna go over there. We're... Yeah, it's, I mean, so much for... I thought we were out of Bound Moon for so long, and now we're back here again. Well... Well, it's just me being lazy at times. I mean, I'm... I mean, yeah, I mean... Sometimes I get tired, sometimes I'm not feeling at the moment or something like that. It depends on my mood. But I am rec I am playing right now. So yeah. Now... Oh, fountains of milk. Oh, that's the fountain of milk? Uh, how do I even get to... I mean, I see cows. Uh... So these are fountains of milk. Jeez, is that real milk for real? Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> of course, it's the freshest, creamiest milk there is. And there's so much of it. And you just keep trying until you get it right. Well, guys, do you find milk disgusting? I mean, yeah, I mean, I used to dislike milk when I was younger, but I like it. Keep trying? You think I can, you can't, I can't do it, huh? I didn't mean to buy it. Come on, you got conjurer some milk. Focus, focus, focus. Now you know how cheese is made. Yeah, for milk. I know that. Sure, you heat some milk and you add lemon and salt and you skim the oil part of the top and turns into cheese. Well, I mean, regular cheese monger, you are. This should be cheesy peasy, ain't it? All you need is right spell, ain't it? Sure, let's take a let me take a look. Wait, hold on. Uh. Uh. Now, how do I even do this? Uh, oh, this one. 
Secret ingredient! Look at that, it's flipping working. It really is. You're so good at magic, Oliver. Bet you could make the sweets if you put your mind into it. And cakes, ooh, you could just eat a... Hey, stop that! He's trying to concentrate. I'm trying to... Yeah, yeah, I'm trying to concentrate. Wow. Well, um, okay, don't turn all the... Hey! Just turn some of the milk into cheese. Don't use all of it. Oh no. I hope a mouse doesn't take it away. You you obtained a giant cheese wedge. Look at the flipping size, man. And you you went and make some sweets and all. That was Esther's fault. Hee <laughs> hee, I bet you wanted some too, didn't you? You shouldn't distract someone when they're trying to cast a spell. Oh, don't be like that. Now we can see that Okalipa, our person, is on a little large side, but I don't suppose it will matter. The bigger than better, I reckon. Let's go take a blazer with cheese. Yeah, this episode is going a bit longer, but eh. All right. Good day to you. How may I be a service? We brought some cheese to give to Kalipa, Mr. Abolser. The cheese? Praise to be the ancients. I thought there would be none, none remaining out all the ant land. The Kalipa can get enough of it. Huh? How did you hear this? A secret known to the oh, no, those in the, within the palace. No matter you are correct, her music is indeed a great admirer of cheese in many forms. He will, he will undoubtedly grant an audience to any who comes bearing with such a gift. Please, you mustn't follow me. Quickly. Alright, let's go deliver to her. Jeepers. That's the Khalifa? She probably ended up this way because of... Shadar, the stinking rot bag. Oh. What is that divine aroma? Abba! Hear your majesty. Bountiful Khalifa, his humble servants come bearing most delicious treatment. Whoa. Careful! Heavens, what a dear sweet child. Bring it to us now, there's a good boy. Please. Uh, huh? You want me to take it to her? Quickly now, young man, bring it to us. Hurry! <laughs> Delicious cheesy ways. Do you have more for us? More? Kaulifa, if you continue to eat so prodigiously, I fear you may burst. A bull! We are hungry! Your request does not go unheard, Majesty, but I fear for your bovinity's well-being. That there is one utterly broken heart. What? But... She might not look broken-hearted, but depending on which bit of heart is missing, all manner of weird things can happen. See, what her Majesty's lacking right now is a drop of restraint. Restraint? That's right. And without it, she can't control the urge to stuff her right royal face. We won't be getting any favors out of her until we've sorted this out. You mark my words. Okay. So we need to find some restraint somewhere, huh? That's quick of you, Ollie boy. You have been paying attention after all. Let's go then, shall we? Please, you must do all you can to help her majesty. Restraint, huh? Can you think of anyone with a lot of restraint, Esther? <clears> hmm, <throat> let me see. There must there must be someone. Can we use a locket to try to look for someone but this in this big old town man? Let's let's try the shopkeepers first, shall we? That's a neat idea, Mr. Trippy. The peen the uh, the people who no owns the town town the shops knows everybody in the town and they hear all the news too. They do great. Let's ask around all the shops then. Yeah. Oh, is that so? Well, well. They got into the palace, did they? And and what did they talk about? Did they now? Okay, keep me posted what's going on inside. And my payment? 
Don't worry, I'll get your reward. By the next time we meet, I'll have scored you something decent. You mean that you will you will steal something? No, no, don't be stupid. It's just a figure of speech. Now concentrate on the job at hand, will you? I'm counting on you to keep an eye on us and ears. Don't let me down. All right, now where do we go? I guess we're going to go to the talk to that crow guy. All right, let's go see the crow guy. Yeah, the backtracking and weeb. Well, I mean, it's just to be expected, but... Eh. I mean, I can't even ride on the boat. Had to wear swimsuits. And now we had to go... F now, now we... Ah, I'm not even quested. Ka, you were troubled? If it's equipment tough enough to survive the harsh desert environment you're after, you come to the right place. Uh, actually, we came to ask you something. We need somebody... We need to find somebody who's a lot of... Uh, with a lot of constraint... But nobody seems to know a person that you must you must be rooking all over the wrong place. Unless I'm a raven ma mad, I know just the person. Oh, do you know, do you? Who is it? You have to tell us, please. Above, cause if I had the patience, I would be crawling about about all over town. A ball? That's right. The little bird told me quite a story about him. That was a few years ago now. One day, Calippa. I decided the boo that she wouldn't be content until she had tasted all the cheese in the world. Cheese? I guess she's really just like Miss Lilia, huh? Without a moment's hesitation, a ball is set to rook. Hmm, through forest and cross he went, battered by blizzards, often surviving a little more than wing and prayer. But finally he comes home to roost, and he did. There is a car pile up with every cheese under the sun. Cow blimey, it was must be sank. Now that's why I call uh Ka restraint. And by good he does need it. And her moose is crawling out of him at all the time. Crack it. There must be impressive. He did all that. He risked his life and everything. Just so her moose stiff could have a snack. Heidi. I think we found her all, all mad, holy boy. Nito! We should find him right away. Eh. Alright, I think. I think I'm just gonna leave it right there, guys. So, yeah, the episode... I mean, we're gonna leave it up today. Tomorrow, we're gonna uh, continue. Because I got some stuff to do IRL. So, yeah. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. So, like, comment, because you're subscribing. And we're gonna go see... Uh, we're gonna find a person who is... Who is uh, who is full of restraint and weeb. So, yeah. Alright then. So, alright then. Until next time, take care. And if you're new here, consider checking out my Let's Plays. That's what I'm doing.